respect and peace. I'm your host, Ultimate Mayo420, if you sweet people didn't know already. And today we're going to be continuing with our blind run of part 2 of Outlast Baby on the PC in stereoscopic 3D. I'm playing this game in 3D via NVIDIA 3D Vision, and this is part 2 of our blind run. We have reached the sewers, and we are trying to escape uh, that big fat guy that rips your head off. I forgot his name already. But anyway, let's go ahead and click continue game. And let's see how the rest of this game <laughs> unfolds, man. This game is creepy, I tell you that now. Oh. Here we go, man. This game looks sensational in 3D, baby. Oh, yeah. Look at this. All right, so we've got to pull these two switches. <laughs> Lower junction. There's our friend. He's our best friend. Look at him, man. With his uh, breasts and big belly and chains and... What, what the hell happened to his face, man? Seriously, like... This guy is fucked. <laughs> he, he heard me, man. Fat bitch, you fat bitch, you can't find me. You a son of a fatty, and you are even fatter. Yeah. You are stupid. You won't search this locker. <laughs> Sucker, get out of here. <laughs> right, here we go. Uh -uh. Let's turn this now. I think he's gonna come back here now. now. Look at this stupid sucker. <laughs> come on, man, search my locker. He is fat. And stupid. <laughs> All right then, let's uh get out of here. There he is. There's a shadow, and we just follow him nice and slow. Hello, my friend. I'm going here, like so. And now we just uh, wait for him now. To basically go back that way. It's a lovely game. You got that right, Sevy boy. But I'm getting bored of this waiting, man. This waiting is testing my sexy patience. Or lack thereof, I should say. There's our fat friend right there. Oopsie. Go 
Don't you even think about turning around, fat boy. Can you go through here? There's no lockers here, man. All right, let's do this. Don't go through there just yet, man. Bloody hell, you don't know where the fat guy is. Let's just go there and find out. We it's already saved the game anyway, so if we die, it's not gonna be the end of the world. Uh, is this a dead end? I thought I heard some footsteps there. Where's the fat guy, man? Hello, fatty, 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 where are you? I want to be your best friend. Fat boy? Oh, fat boy. Where did you go? Oh, I, sh I hear him. No, 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 no. <laughs> I just need there he is. Haha, <laughs> you can't see me, you fat bitch. Shit, why is he coming back this way for that? <laughs> why, man? Why? Oh, boy. Oh, no. What's he doing now? Now, okay. Where'd he go? I just need to get a gauge on where he is. Oh, shit, I can hear him on the left hand side, I think.
Come on in, bruh. Why you move so slow? Can't you just walk over there so I can just run behind you? I'm starting to wonder if there's any documents or anything that I can pick up around here. <laughs> Lol. Oh, we going down. The long time he's just gonna jump down after us, man. With his big fat belly. Oh crap! I need the batteries, man. Holy shit bags. Where are we now? Oh, come on. This place is just fucked in the butt, man. Ugh, yuck. The ladder. Uh oh, I don't like that, but there's somebody up there. But I've got no choice but to climb. <laughs> he better be a friendly bat. What the fuck? Somebody got wrecked. hell is that man what the hell How's that even possible? How's he dead then? Like, I mean, how's he experimenting on you guys? Like, uh, uh, bruh, what the hell? Ugh. Yuck. There's a way down there, I guess. And what's this here? Like, okay. So he made us scribble some notes. The doctor is dead. The patients know Dr. Wernick is dead. One asks me, what kind of experiments does a dead doctor perform on living patients? What is Project Wall Rider? Yeah, what is Project Wall Rider, guys? That's what I want to know. Is that a note? Can you pick this up? No? Okay. And the batteries deplete so fast in this, I swear. You better have something for me, like. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby battery. Yeah. I'm uh, glad to see you batteries. These better be Duracell, man. Mm, none of that cheap shit, like, you know what I'm saying? Right, down we go. Saving again, yeah? Okay, male ward, female ward. Oh, fuck. Object, find a way out of the sewers. Alright, let's go to the female ward, man. Let's check out the ladies. Oh, man, why the pussy blocked, man? Talk about a big cock block, man. What the, what the hell is that all about, man? Seriously. Like, 
Ugh. Come on, man. Where the pussy? Ugh. What the? <laughs> oh, man. These people are very friendly, I tell you, man. There's someone's leg there. What's that all about, man? Come on, man. Oh. This, this, this game is nasty. What, what is that? Like, seriously, what is that, man? What, 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 what is that? What was that? Guy has to stop breathing so heavily, man. Seriously, like, can't hear nothing because he keeps breathing. That. But that's just someone's face. Shit! Somebody got wrecked. Oh no. Alright, so we've got to crawl, crawl through here? Okay then. Yo, Pagan, getting scared, Ultimate? Nah, 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 nah. Come on, man. How am I scared? This, this game's full of suspense, man. I'll tell you that now. Oh shit, I'm running out of batteries here. Oh no. Me no like it when I run out of batteries. This is one way. Now I've got to check the other way. And tact. <laughs> Traditionally it's blocked. What a waste of time. Alright, so let's continue going this way then. So this is the grate that we were blocked by. Is that a ladder? There's two doors here. Which one do we take, man? Oh, you play in 3D, of course, like always. Yep. Stereoscopic 3D, bro. That's the way. So it, it looks it looks like you're actually there. You're holding the camera, and it's like it's it's just crazy in 3D, man. Trust me, like 3D is definitely the way to play this game. Oh shit! Okay, it's dark in there. Can we? What the fuck? What are you doing, bruh? Hello, my friend. How comes your teeth are so fucked? Like, why? Why do these people look like they've had their their face like completely fucking rearranged with some crazy plastic surgeon? Like, this reminds me of the plastic surgeon in Bioshock, man. Uh, you ever tried VR? Opinion? On, I, I've I've not tried VR, man. But like, my opinion so far is that it's probably the same as as three D vision. Um, except it's it's stuck to your face, and that you have Wiimotes in your hands, and it has head tracking on the helmet, and that's about it really. Well, it moves the camera, so you've got head tracking on the helmet that moves the camera like this, and then you have Wiimotes in your hands that actually just move move things around like. So this guy's just here for show, sure, like. Hello, my friend. What are you saying, bro? Oh my days, man. What the fuck did they do to this guy? Like, I mean, is that his skin? 
Are those his real eyes? I mean, how do these people... How does he even eat, man? How's he supposed to stay alive? Like? Can he even breathe? Ugh. Anyway. There's no point worrying about this guy. Uh-oh. So it looks like it's a one-way road. I'll press R to reload the batteries. Oh, shit bags. I'm out of the light juice. Uh, it looks like these batteries are not, not, are not Duracell, man. Uh-oh. Okay, I don't, don't like the look of this. Oh, hang on a second. Yeah, this better be Duracell, man. Okay, how do we get out of here? We'll jump from there. Go through here. Are we going this way? But this is blocked by a grate. We jumped off there. Oh, we must be going up there then. Whew, okay. I think I just heard somebody. Can you swim? I'm surprised that this camera is still functioning. After all the abuse and falls and bumps this guy has taken. Like, this camera is tough, man. This camera be doing it for him, like. Where am I? What the hell? We just gone in a circle, like. Uh, I'm lost, man. I'm supposed to go there. We must. It must be there then. I am lost, man. This is confusing. What the hell was that? Oh, we're supposed to go through here. Okay. Alright. I just got the saving screen. I can hear somebody else. I hear chains. Is it him? Is it the big fat dude? What the hell is he doing down here? Shit, he's here somewhere. Oi. Oh, hey, nah. Where the fuck is he, man? Which way am I supposed to go? This whole room is just fucking dark, man! Uh. 
Oh, this is just this is tense, man. Max, just which one I supposed to call, man? Am I supposed to go up here? Fuck. Shit, there he is, fuck! <laughs> it's him! This fat bitch boy! <laughs> Lol. Whew. Oh man. Oh, that was tense, Mama. Oh. Why is this? Why is this guy just? Bruh, what, what did they do to your face, bruh? Come on, man. What's going on, man? Oh, we're in the male ward now. What the fuck? Hell, what, what the fuck? I don't even know which way I'm going, if this is the right way. What the hell? This guy's in a straight jacket, just sitting here, sobbing like a fucking baby. And he's just crying his eyes out, man. Shit. Why are these people so fucked? What is this guy doing, man? You know, I, I, I'm not even gonna ask him, man. The male ward. Oh. We're in this crazy place again. We just we just got out of the sewers and now we gotta find a way back out of the sewers. Like, oh, come on, man. Hey, 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 come back here, bro. Who was that? What the hell? I can't make sense of what's going on in this game. I'm getting some FPS drops. I think it's just loading a new area. Let me let me just wait for it to just uh, smooth itself out. Like, there we go. No, what the fuck, man? Uh shit. Let's press N for notes. The feast for flies. I thought this sewer couldn't smell any worse. Hundreds of bodies crammed into a room. Thousands of flies. Is this the priest's way out? Mail ward. Yeah, here we go. 
Press R to reload the batteries. New objective. Reach the ground floor of the male ward. Oh, crap. Oh, looks like there's a vent here. Can you move this thing? Oh. Is this the guy that was running? Yeah, it was him that was running. Why is he running around in the sewers for that? Like, what the hell? I can't understand any of this stuff, man. What is going on in this game? This whole game is weird, man. Like, he's just humbly sitting there. It's like he's upset. It's like he's accepted his own imprisonment, man. Like this guy, like, like bro, what's wrong with you, man? Shit, he can't see and he can't talk, man. Damn. Ugh. Okay, let's open sesame here, man. going on here I'm not liking how dark this room is man shit uh, I've got one battery I don't know if I should use it now man this is somebody's chair Uh, let me grab some water. Whew. <laughs> oh man. This game is tense, I tell you at now. Man. Ah. So that's the way we were blocked. We went round this way. There was nothing here. That's one way for me to check. Uh, what is this way? Mm, wait, let me check this way first. Though. Where does this lead, man? Up the stairs. Oh fuck, this is blocked. Okay, there's a... Can't go through here, it's boarded up. I don't like the look of this. Why is this guy just on the floor, like? What the hell? He's not saying nothing. Bruh, say something, man. We actually have to open this door now? Alright, who was knocking on the door then? Bring it, rude boy.
Alright, let's try open this door. That's locked. This guy here, this guy is also locked. So my choices are either to hang around in this room, which obviously is a dead end. Can you break this stuff? Nope. So it looks like I only got one way to go. Oh man, this is this reminds me of that room in Resident Evil called Veronica, man. Oh shit. <laughs> oh man. Oh, there better not be some zombies in this game. Oh, I'll gladly take those for sure, man. Someone just had their leg and their intestines and bowels just removed, man. What the? Why can't you just move the curtain and see what's behind there, man? Or why the suspense? Oh no, what is this, man? Is that someone's arm? Someone's... Ugh, man. Oh, man. This game is nasty, that. Some disturbed people here, man. Shit. Oi, no. Oh, what? This guy got chopped, man. Oh, he got chopped. Hey, they completely stripped the bone from the flesh. I mean, the flesh from the bone, excuse me, man. Hey, why would they do that, man? That's nasty, that. Oh, man. Taco Bell dinner intensive war. <laughs> what is going on, bro? Hey. hey, this is nasty, man. Where's the documents? There we go. Project Board Rider Cost Report. Okay. Patient Status Report by Rick Traeger. This Patient Status Report by Rick Traeger. Okay, who the hell is Tra Rick Traeger? This patient also unfortunately didn't make it. I tried my best, but I'm just a doctor, not a miracle worker. And I'm pretty new to this whole doctor thing, so I'm still working all, uh, working out all the kinks. Anyhow, somebody's got to cut the fat from this Project Wall Rider disaster. Cut the fat. <laughs> cut the fat from this Project Wall Rider disaster. Who is this dumb doctor, man? We've been bleeding money ever since this thing went tits up on account of that Billy kid. But I've managed to slim back personnel by more than 80 people which means short-term savings in salary and long-term savings in pension and healthcare costs. To slim back personnel, I'm guessing he means he's killed people off, right? And I've been figuring out a lot about biology. I was on the fence about it before, but now I can say with absolute certainty that the person can't live without his kidneys. You learn something new every day. Oh my days, damn. That's nasty, man. This guy is... Ugh. Ugh. Uh, congrats, several men, congrats. Alright. I think I've got no choice but to go in here. In fact, let me reload the batteries. And I better not waste them. I need more batteries, man. Open sesame, here we go. What the? Okay. Is 
This is an opening. Is there a way around? Is there a button or something? Their moans have gotten louder and the violin is playing faster like... And I can't open this door! How to open the door, man? I don't want to waste my battery in here. Oh, oh. Go up here. Like, all right, here we go. Whew, man. Is that it? What's wrong, bruh? What the fuck? What is happening, man? What do you mean this is the experiment, like? What's he talking about? <laughs> Fucking hell, man. This is tense, man. Oi! <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! Shit! I can't even hear what they're saying, that. Uh. Well, the battery's there. Oh shit, that's, that's blocked off now, I can't... Going this way. Oh my days, where are we going? Oh boy. Oh my days. Oi. That was tense, man. What happened to that guy strapped to the chair, man? Oh shit! What the? What the? Oh crap! I have to go this way. <laughs> oh crap. That door is locked. Damn. These guys are serious, man. Wait, 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 let me. What? <laughs> Okay, here we go. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, you're that bullshit priest's guy, aren't you? <sighs> His witness or whatever. You must be 
Exhausted. Now, let's take a break, huh, buddy? The old two martini lunch. Hmm? Have a little confab. Blah, blah, blah. Brilliant than you look. A little car you wouldn't kill you. Okay, here we go, arms and legs inside the car at all times. <laughs> Who the hell is this guy? Is this the evil doctor? What the f what the fuck if he was trying to help me, man? Oh, isn't this? Oh, this looks like the beginning, but it's not. It's actually. Oh no, the exit's right there. Oh, you son of a bitch. No? Alright. Those are the grindstone. I like that. Okay, then. Right this way. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Why has he got so many tubes in his arms? Like. There's blood everywhere, man. What the hell? Remember, not found any use anyway. Because he told her, it's just time to look at my own stairs. He cut his tongue out? Oh. Oh, bro, don't show me your ass like that, man. Nobody wants to see that, man. Oh, yeah, let's get out of here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. I'm a bit worried how much time you've been spending with Father Martin. I know. I hope you haven't been letting him confuse you with all this holier-than-thou Bible something. No, what's he going to do? Oi, 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 oi. God died with the gold standard. We're on to a more concrete thing now. You have to rob Paul to pay Peter. There's no other way. Murder in it is the simplest one. But what happens? No, what the, the what the, 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 all the money's gone. What's he talking about, man? Well, I don't owe you no money. And that's what I'm here for. It makes you believe. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! Shit! No more PC gaming for this guy, man. GG, la. Oh no, man. Oh, hey. What the? F Fuck it all, man. Shit. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. shit. This is nasty, man. Hey. Oh. What the? Oh, oh. So this is the guy that's been chopping everyone up, like. Man, if he wanted to chop things up, why didn't he just fucking start a butcher's career? I mean, like... <laughs> what the hell, man? Oh, my days. Oh, man. You know, I'm, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna... <laughs> I, I, I need to... I, I, <laughs> I need a break from that, man. Shit. Oh, man.
Ah, uh, sorry about that, my sweet people. I had to empty my bladder there. Like. <laughs> okay, man. That was some serious suspense, man. Shit. Ugh. Damn. I, I, we're going to get payback for this, man. I swear. Oh, at least we better get payback for this, man. <clears throat> Fuck, you know, man. No more gaming for this guy. No more PC gaming, man. Rip. Rip PC gaming, man. He's, he's gonna have to go back to console with those thumbs. Where is he? Oh shit, what the fuck? What the fuck is going on, man? What do you mean you, you, you don't make the rules? What the fuck are you talking about, man? Oh, what the... Oh, oh, crap. Oh, you got me, you got me. Okay, so wait, 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 what the hell just happened? Like, we walked into that room, the guy's tied to the bed. He says he's not a patient, he's an executive, just like Tega. So, if my understanding is correct, the guy that just chopped off my, my fingers, he's Tega. And something happened to him that made him crazy that they couldn't control, and he's the one responsible for this whole place going batshit crazy. Am I right? Or am I wrong? I was too busy trying to listen to what he had to say, man. Traeger, huh? He got treatment. Who's Wernick? Shit, 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 shit. Ooh. I wanted to get a better view, man, and he just kind of came out the bed. Like. Oh. Oh, damn. <clears throat> now we're going to try that again. Is the battery here, though? What the hell? Oh, 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 oh. I see what's up. Uh, 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 
your horn. You want a little attention. Perfectly understandable. I'm here for you. I'll give you very special attention. What the hell? You just killed him now. Oh, oh, he just realized I've gone missing. Oh, crap. This is tense, man. I've got to now escape this idiot. First, it was the big fat guy. Now it's this Tiger, who's some fucking executive. Where is he going? I need to work out his route first, man. Okay. Did he go? Alright, where is he now? Is that door openable? He's gonna come. Where is he? Oh, he's there. Oh, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna have to work my way around all the beds. Oh, the game's good, man. The game's good. I like the detail and everything, like. It's full of suspense, though, like. But I just can't understand what the hell is going on. How did he not see me, man? <laughs> hey, with the big scissors and shit, that. Ooh. Oh, she's gonna start checking under the beds. No. Yeah. Sure, it was an amateur move, bitch boy. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Where'd he go? Where is he? I can't see because the fucking pillar, man. He's not going to go through the door, is he? Because that door's locked. Alright. So now which way does he go? Does he go all the way outside the room? So he just goes and stands by the door and looks. And then what? I need to work out his route, man. I can't see where he goes from here, so I'd... Uh... And he comes back so quick! How am I supposed to get past him, though? Fuck, man! Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh shit. Okay. 
This game is easy compared to CS. <laughs> well, we've made some swift progress. I don't know how much more of the game is left to go, though. Oh, it's not going to be that easy, is it? Need elevator key, of course. Fucking hell, man. Oof, here we go. Okay. All right. Oh shit, man. I've only got like one battery, man. So wait, I'm supposed to move this thing? I need to work out where he is. He's not here. Ah, all right, so we've gone full circle here, like. Oof. Where's the key, man? Fuck. Don't tell, me, don't tell me you heard that. Don't crouch, he's gonna hear me, right? He goes that way. Is he coming back? I think he's coming back. Don't come back, fam. Let's teach you the seven habits of highly eviscerated people. Oh shit! <laughs> I don't know where to. Go. I don't know where to go, man. Well, if he's patrolling that side, I should probably go around the other side. Oops. Because we open the door. Nobody likes you, bro. You're a fucking freak, man. I can't believe what he said earlier. It's like, hey, I don't make the rules. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? You don't make the rules. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. If he's patrolling this corridor, I might as well try my luck on the other corridor then.
He's gone that way. You can't go around here. Does he come here again? Or is he just gonna patrol the other side now? A Dr. Rick Traeger, okay. Traeger, sick fucker, cut my fingers off. So he's Traeger, okay. Has tortured and mangled dozens of patients. I watch him murder another one. Nothing I can do about it. Talks like a white collar business school douchebag. Probably has a set of golf clubs in the truck of his Audi. I bet the rest of my fingers he was I bet the rest of my fingers he was Murkoff brass before whatever infected this place changed him. I want out of this place. I want my fucking fingers back. I want to see Traeger die. Is he is he gonna come this way, man? No, the downside of hiding is you never know where the people you're hiding from are. Alright, fuck it, man. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's gonna come this way, man. He got wrecked. Maybe I can get a better vantage point from here. Oh shit! <laughs> Landed right on top of him, man. After all of that. And don't tell me I have to do all of that again, man. Where am I? What is this room, man? Mm. Does, does he come in here? Meander from bed to bed. Where is the key at, man? Is the key in this room? Am I even in the right room? Like, I don't want to come out of the bed and he's right there and then he just sees me. Oh, there he is. Okay. Alright, there we go. Shit, now I can't even see him. Now. Okay. Is that a document for me to pick up?
This is not wise. There's light here. Where am I? Oh, dude, come on, look around a bit better, man. What is that sound? I can hear some change going off like. This guy. These two are still alive. How is he still? How is how is he still alive with his bone hanging out and everything, man? Another dude here. Where is the key, man? Does he have the key? And he cut his toes off and everything, the bloody hell, man. Sign of Kruger or Trigger or whatever the hell his name is, man. Oh, my days, are you for real, man? We got all... Oh, he's there. All right, let's go. <laughs> That's who I am. And you squeeze under the cubicles. Buddy! Oh crap, you son of a bitch. No, no. No! Oh, <laughs> I tried to jump over him, man. <laughs> oh, after all that suspense, man. Oh, we're back here again. I gotta do this nonsense, slut. Like. Chummy, 
Suspense is real, man. All right, so we'll go through here. Gently, very gently open this door. Go through here. Oh, you can't. Are you serious? You can't make it out through there because that little fence is in the way when there's plenty of space behind. Come on, man. Some batteries would be nice. Oh. I don't even know how he saw me, man. Oh shit, let's not waste this. Where, where'd he go? Is he in this room? Footsteps. Oh, this is testing my patience now, man. Come on, just walk over there so I can do my thing over there, man. He won't leave there, like. Lol. <laughs> How did he not see me, man? That's his shadow right there, isn't it?
There he is. I slammed that shot. <laughs> I was trying to close it gently, man, but fuck, you know. Open the door. Well, you can't open the door with your missing finger? Come on, man. What? We're trapped in here? Open this door! Oh, what now, man? Oh my days, it's GG! We're trapped in it! What the fuck? I'm trapped. Oh shit. <laughs> so I've got to wait for him to open the door. Like. Oh. Buddy. This, this guy was fake friendship, like. Ugh. Oh, here we go again. I gotta do. I gotta. Oh, you serious, boss man? Come on, man. This is wrong. <laughs> where where is he then? I don't even know where this key is, man. What the hell are you talking about? You don't make the rules, bruh. Whose game is this then? Look, listen to this idiot, look.
Oh. He goes all the way over there. And then he comes back. <laughs> and then he sees you, it's like, buddy! Uh, Alright. Where is this bloody key, man? around here fucking hell man there he is Oh shit! He saw me, man! <laughs> oh man! Oh boy! Man, why'd you close this whole... Oh, the key's not gonna be in here now, is it? Oh, man. This place is nasty, man. We want to go through that way, like. All right. Where is he? I can hear him. There he is. Is this tense? Yeah. I should have got his first. That's because you are amateur, you bitch. So we're here. Can you not like hide in the dark? Wait, wait. Is that door? Can you open that door?
is right there. I'm gonna be pissed if this is the door, man. Oh, this is the damn toilet, man. Well, this is also a dead end. No batteries here. <sighs> All right. I can't. I can't work. Work his pattern out, man. Am I supposed to? Oof. There we go. Whew. But we're supposed to look for the key. That's why I didn't bother looking for that. Looking at the vents. Look at the objective. Reach the ground floor of the male ward. But we need the key for the fucking elevator, man. He must know where this where this elevator where where this shaft leads. Key, please. Yes. Oh, my days. How do I get out of here? Shit. Oh, I'm gonna have to play this game. <laughs> Where is he? Shit, don't come this way, bro. <laughs> this is tense, man. He's just gonna keep walking from there to there, from there to the back. Stop, man. Go over there somewhere so I can move. Oh my days, he's gonna keep... Yes! 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 <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Oh 
yeah! Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh shit! Ooh, ooh! Ooh! <laughs> yeah, he deserved that. Get wrecked, bitch. You deserve that, man. Revenge! Yeah! That's what you get for cutting off my gaming fingers, bruh. Bitch boy! Yeah! Oh, man. Whew, what a relief. That was long. That was tense, man. Bloody hell. Fuck it out, man. Yeah, I can see the comments, man. <clears throat> Shit. This asshole, man. Fuck, you know. He got squished. Alright. How, how do we get out of here, though? Oh, we, we, we've got to get, get out from there. Like. Boom. Oof. Oof, man. That was some tense mamacita right there. Ooh, we got squished. No, 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 don't reload the... Oh, why, man? He got laid out. <laughs> the death of Traeger. How to make treasure juice. Step one. Squeeze. Traeger juice. Hey, isn't this that guy? Archbishop Wolford Panzerium of the Denver Archidocios. Who the hell is this guy? Thomas Willett, 1966. 1958. Let me guess. So, this guy right here has had his personality injected into that priest guy. Am I right? Well, we, we shall see, I guess. Because clearly this game is not set in the 1950s. Are we going up? Batteries. Looks like we're going down. But before I do that, let me just browse this area one last time. Jermaine Delaire, Deputy Director, Colonial Hydrotherapy. Father Thomas Willett. He was also our father. Huh? Who's this guy, man? So, there's definitely some kind of hypnosis going on here while people are asleep. Batteries, batteries, batteries. Come on, man. There should have been some batteries here. Come on, man. Teamwork. Team Player Award. Patrick Petriana. Employee of Murkoff Corp. Who best exemplifies the team concepts? Oh, man. We are out of that place, man. Damn. There's got to be a file in here somewhere. Like. Oh, I love the screensaver. Something bad's gonna happen in here, isn't it? Thank God you survived. What the fuck? Even if that secular maniac would carve you up like the others. Meet me outside. We're close now. This son of a bitch, you put me in here, you son of a bitch. I wanted to leave, man. He's like, meet me outside.
Batteries. Batteries, yay! What the hell? How is the kitchen? How is that sink even? The bathroom sink even <laughs> maintaining those flames? Am I going the right way? Oh shit. I don't like the look of this. Am I even going the right way? Is that what I think it is? It is. Yay. Okay. All right. Documents. Let's see. Okay. Persectorial. What? Persectorial delusions. From R. Traeger to P. Walsh. So we kill Traeger. Mr. Walsh, please accept the immediate resignation of orderly blah 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 David Anapurna and process him as a patient of. Mount Massive to treat his persectorial delusions. Treatment should continue until the time of his death. Thanks, buddy. Rick Traeger. Merc of R&D. Please accept the immediate resignation. So people res uh, resign and then he will just kill him off like... Shit! This Traeger guy is an asshole, man. Glad we killed him. Batteries? No batteries that way. Glass. Oh, are we gonna jump over there? This place is locked off. Okay, what about this place, man? This is a dead end as well. Any, 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 any batteries? I swear the only useful items are like files that you can pick up or batteries. There's nothing else you can get, is there? Like this place is on fire now. Like. Holy shit! I better not drop frames here. This place is on fire, man. Who set this place on fire? Like? Turn on the sprinkler system to extinguish the fire. Oh, this guy's burning this place, man. Tell me what the hell happened here, man. Damn. Let it burn. Okay. I'm not the only victim here. Not by a long shot. I watch a man wait to burn to death. The most painful death imaginable. Rather than stay in this place. Am I going the right way? Is this the way to the kitchen? Oh, come on. The batteries run out too quickly, man.
What the hell happened to this guy? Oh, there's a file here. Okay. Uh, turn on the sprinkler system to extinguish the fire. Psychopathological proximity stress disorder pamphlet. If you're seeing this, say something. There's no shame in psychopathological proximity stress disorder. Talk to your supervisor to get help from a Murkoff success counselor. I thought that was a battery, man. Can't go through there. So it looks like my only way out of here is through here. Oh, man, this guy has missing fingers now, like shit. Press R to reload batteries. Do I really want to do that, man? If there's no water in the system, you must first turn on the two valves. And the valves are located where? Bart's laundry. Turn on to extinguish the fire. Well, where's the valves at, man? No! Fuck, man. Oh, not this one. This is this is this is what this is a one. He's gonna see me, like. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, damn. Why are you updating to Windows 11? Why would you do that, man? Windows 11 is so beta like. Oh, shit. I hide in the dark. Fuck, man, I've got no choice but to hide in here now. Oh, he's probably gonna catch me. But it's fine, we'll just reload the save. Where is he, man? Come on, now. His, the sound of his chains is fading away, so maybe he's gone now.
Oh, I hate it when the fucking batteries run out in this game, man. Lol. <laughs> oh, MG. That was madness. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Mama Sita, man, damn. Oh, man, this fat son of a bitch is serious, man. Don't know which way I'm supposed to go. Is this the right way? We hide in the dark here. And we pray that he doesn't see me that. But I think he will. Anyone <laughs> I bet he was gonna see me, man. Okay. Laundry room. Batteries, 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 no batteries. Oh, damn it, man. Batteries, batteries, batteries. Where's the valve then? Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh. Cafeteria. Baths and laundry. Okay, so we've got to go through here. Press this button. Out this way. Oh, that's not so bad once you know the once you actually know the route. Hide in the dark here. Please don't tell me he's gonna come looking for me in here. Where is he? There he is. So that's one. Where is he?
Where is he? We've done laundry buffs is that way. Fuck, are you serious, man? Dude, the guy is dead. What are you rubbing him up for, man? What the hell? Well, this is what I don't understand. Why is this game so weird, man? No, no, no. Don't go through there just yet. Oh. Alright. Oh, fuck it, man. <laughs> Cause you got force updates set set to enabled, man. Hello, my fat friend. What are you saying, bruh? Right, they gave this guy some serious roidage, man. Take a right, please. Oh, he has to go straight ahead, in it. I think this camera's losing focus, look. Oh. Don't turn around. There we go. Okay. And I hope this is the right way. Nope, this ain't the right way, man. Oh, fuck. This is not the right way, man. Where is he? Oh, this is a headache, man. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? Oi. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's the thing with laptops, man. I have to do this all over again? Oh, for fuck's sake. This is taking too much time, man. Are you fucking kidding me, man? I have to wait for him to come back round and do. Oh. I 
Yeah, there's this program that you can use called Sledgehammer to stop Windows updates. It's what I used, isn't it? But then if, if to stop the Windows updates. But then it, when I re-enabled it, it messed up the Windows. Oh, this is getting seriously tedious, this section here, man. Is he going to come in here? I'll try one or two more times to do this section, but after we do this section, I'm, I'm probably going to going to end the session, man. <clears throat> and we'll continue with the rest of the game tomorrow. This is this is getting getting kind of repetitive now, like. Where is he? All I can hear is jing, 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 jing from his fucking chains, look. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, this is just fucking annoying now, man. <laughs> Endless chapter one of Evil Within. <laughs> he has just has to come your way as well, like it's like, dude. There he is. It's camping. I know it's like Call of Duty player, isn't it? Well, this is the laundry. The source of laundry. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my days, man! <laughs> oh shit! That is bullshit, man. Like, and you called as well. He was camping, and he's literally just camping right here, man. Sweet ass time, you fat son of a bitch. What the fuck? Oh, come on, man. I just saw you leave the fucking room, like.
it would just camp there in the middle, like, and then it's like, you, oh, you just test your fucking patience, man. No, what a noob camper, like, it's a noob. AI noob. There he is. I have no idea where the hell he is, man. Fuck. <laughs> yeah Okay, so we want to go Bots, we want to go over to the bots, where is he? Alright Bingo. Nice. Did you bring your ducky? What duck are you talking about, bruh? He wants to clean the belly. Find Wocky. This guy is crazy, man. No batteries here. No batteries there. And no batteries there. Shit. No batteries in here. Whoa, 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 man. Oh, come on, let me have a look, man. Where is he? I need, I need to know where he is now. So what we need to do is we need to come out, go into the middle. Which, which way was it now, man? Oh, fuck. Here's the thing, I don't want to walk down the corridor and then he's just there camping like, and then I'm like, oh shit bags. <laughs> free and free. <laughs> Alright, here we go, man. I've already left it too long anyway. Oh, see, I knew it, man. He's just he's just there camping like. I bet you any money he was camping there, like, the AI had him camping, like. 
All right, you fat son of a bitch. I'm surprised you can't see me here, man. It's not like there's no light here. Which way was it, man? I just need to make it through the right way. That's the laundry room. Here we go, bingo! There he is! Oh, Alright, now, now we get through here. We get out of here, like, boom. Yo! Makita von Vida, hey, I see you changed your name. This is creepy indeed, yeah. <laughs> Damn straight, this is creepy. Um, <coughs> have you played this before? This, this is the first time for me playing this stuff. Uh, let's go back and speak to this guy. Assuming he didn't just burn to death already, like. Bloody hell, man, this place is fucked. You've not played this? Whew. Yo, RM Dizzle, what's going on, my brother? How are you, man? It's good to see you in the house, too, man. This game is tense. I tell you, like, if you, if you like horror games, then you, you'll be at home with this game. But if you're somebody that gets scared easily... Then this might not be for you. <laughs> right, now I just need to find my way out of here. What's the objective here? Find the farther mountain outside. We need to get outside here. Is this the way? Oh, so this is a dead end too. RM says, you played this a lot back in 2014. Oh, so you've played it several times, have you? It's a good game, man. So, no surprise you played it a lot. I have the sequel on Steam as well, like. So, we'll, we'll probably play the sequel straight after this. Or straight after I beat this. First of all, I need to, I need to find a way out of here. And I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I don't want to waste my battery power because the battery in the camera is just so. The batteries. Oh, what? This is a butcher's place. What the fuck? Who is this guy? And he's locked me in here. Whoa! <laughs> what was that all about, man? You beat this game on the hardest difficulty also. Ooh, so you played the one life mode. So I'm playing on hard. So this is a blind run. I've not played this game before. I'm playing on hard. I was going to play on the hardest, but with the hardest one, it's called insane. And with that one, um, if you die, you have to start from the beginning all over again. And for me, that was too much of a, that, 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 that was too much hassle. If it wasn't for that, I would have played it on hardest anyway. But like, judging how the gameplay is, I don't see how else they could have made it harder, but other than set you back to the beginning again, so... This guy got 
butchered, man. Look at that. His leg is there, his, his bowels, his intestines, his liver and shit. Like, then they chopped, they chopped his head off as well. Like, oh my days, these guys wanted some serious protein, man. Oh, shit, man. Oh. So we can go through here, or we can check this room here. I'm going to check out this room here now. Batteries, batteries, batteries. Nope. I swear it's like the only... What the fuck? A bowl of fingers. Are you serious? <laughs> Free organs. <laughs> Oh, man. I said it before, but fuck this place. I've still got those fingers left. Oh. Shit. And this guy had his fingers cut off earlier. I, I don't know if he was uh, if he was here earlier, Kitty, but like, um, shit. Like, uh, he, had his, he had his fingers cut off. I don't know if you can see it here. I'll have to show you somehow. I think you can only see his hands when he's like... But he had he had one finger on each hand cut off like. Santa says, by the way, don't worry. Com compared to the rest, this is acceptable gore. Honestly, you think one of the lead devs of Red Barrel has a mutilator fetish? <laughs> Several says, Outlast 2 is a is a heavy game, man. You doubt your PC can run it in 3D? We shall see. If it can't, then uh, we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll I'll weigh out my options and go from there. Man. Um. Your daughter made you play this on the insane difficulty. It took you four hours to beat it. Oof. But I'm, I'm assuming you played it on insane difficulty after you've played it several times. Because then you kind of know where things are and where to go. So it's not so bad. Oh. Are we going outside? Oh. Oh, this is where that guy takes us in the wheelchair and wheels and wheels us down here, like. And then we kill the trigger guy. Yeah, we gone full circle now. Look at this guy. Yeah, he's dead. If he's watching, bruh, I'm gonna take a stroll outside. All right, but before I do that, let me check out this area for items, man. There's a. Oh, I thought that was a file. Uh, what's here? Is there something else here? Nope. So that police officer got wrecked. There's a broken monitor. This place has been so badly trashed, it's unbelievable, man. There's a new file here. Let's let's pick this up, man. Let's see what this says, like. Notes. Fingers, no. Documents. Here we go. Mkultra program ex excerpt. Mkultra program, CIA, Mori, blah, 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 159 excerpts, 2, file, subject, special research, Bluebird. 1. A general problem. For the past several months, Bluebird has been endeavouring to ascertain by research, study, instruction, and some practice what value can be derived from sleep induction. What value, if any, can be derived from sleep induction. And... H. Hypnotic techniques when applied to war and specific agency problems. 3. Can we create by post H. Control an action contrary to an individual's basic moral principles? 7. Can we guarantee total amnesia under any and all conditions? 8. Can we alter a person's personality? How long will it hold? 17. What are full details on a sleep-inducing machine? So, they're inducing the patients to sleep. They're then giving them instructions, these horrific instructions to carry out these, these gruesome attacks. And then, because we picked up a note earlier where one of them, where they had got two women, they put them both asleep. They, one of the women had a phobia of guns. And they gave that woman a gun and told her to shoot the other woman up. But the gun, in that case, the gun, the scenario was blank. But she did actually pick up and shoot the woman after she had been sleep induced. So they're using sleep as a form of hypnosis. I think that's what's going on here.
you haven't played Outlast 3 though. Is it out? I don't think an Outlast 3 is out. That's probably why you haven't played it, man. And and Vakita says, I think you can, you could alter a person's personality. Well, doing this, you probably could. <laughs> this is some deep shit, man. This is some seriously deep shit. Well, I'm liking this game though, man. I'm liking the suspense. But I'm not liking how it's testing my patience, so it's it's a hit and miss. Look for Father Martin. Alright, now what, man? It's raining and it's pouring hard. How is this camera even working, man? This Is this camera waterproof? Thunder help. Oh, well, this is the wrong way. Alright, so. This needs, this door needs a key. Typical, huh? Someone screaming hard, boy. I'm trying not to use my batteries here because I'm trying to make do with this little light that I have rather than use a battery. Okay, we got stairs here. Where do these stairs lead? Is that a... Oh, what's this? Nice. Let's have a, let's have a read here. Because I like to take in that lore, our own personal cavalry. All right. I don't even know your name, but I've come to think of you as one of my blood. My poor, I hope you don't mind, and I hope you don't indulge the vanity of self-pity. The fear that your suffering is more than others. We all must endure this, and you are nearly done. There's no way to heaven but by the cross, and every man needs another to help drive the nails in. I am here for you. I am waiting ahead. Yeah, it's, it's, it's got the Blair Witch vibes. I was saying that earlier, like, if you watched me play yesterday, like... Uh... Okay, there's another stairs here. There's got to be a way to break this lock. Well, at least he's not being chased by the big fat guy. I right, see this. This kind of stuff starts to annoy me because, like, what the fuck? Are you serious? Did Did you see that? Did Did, did you see that? Or am I seeing things? But yeah, as I was about to say, this kind of stuff pisses me off, because look, right, I can't see where the fuck I'm going, man. I've got to wait for the thunder flash every time. I'm seeing things, man. Oh, no. That can't be a good sign. And well, now we're back in here, like. I don't know, I kind of like it better in here, man. At least there's some lights to... <laughs> Go back to Mount Massive Asylum. Yo, Ghost Mode on, what's going on? Is this GTA? Yeah, man, this is GTA, bro. This is what GTA looks like, man. Yeah, I know, cozy office, like. It's the office is so cozy compared to compared to this. Like, look, look at this. It's raining like crazy out here, like. And it's so dark, I can't see where I'm going. You know. Why would I want to leave that that crazy Mount Massive Asylum, like? So, so far, there's one gate. What's this? How live are you? What? 
How alive are you? What kind of question is that? You're either living and breathing, or you're not, bruh. Unless he means how much you're getting laid. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's a deep question. Uh, too deep, huh? Okay, what? What is that? Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Bingo. There's got to be a key in here. Like, please, there we go. Yeah. Picked up the key to access the maintenance shed. This guy is shitting himself, man. Listen, listen to him breathe. Like. Alright, so we got the shed access now. What's going on in here now? I could really do some batteries right now. I see the little there you see his finger. His finger well, his finger got cut off on each hand, man. You missed it, like it was mud. Are we going back in the rain? Am I going the right way? Everything looks the bloody same. If I could find another set of batteries. This, this priest guy better have an explanation for why he did this to me, man. I was literally about to get out of this place. And then he put me to sleep and put me in the cell. Like, what the fuck? Oi! Am I seeing things or did you guys see that? Like, Tell, t tell me I'm not seeing things. Tell me I'm not seeing things. <laughs> you didn't see anything. <laughs> the thing in the dark. God help me. I think I've seen the wall rider. What the hell is a wall rider, man? What the hell is Project Wall Rider? I thought it was just the name of a project. I'm surprised this camera is still functional, man. In this rain. There's a ladder here. Looks looks to have some promise. But let me check the rest of the area out before we leave. Or climb the ladder. Alright, there doesn't seem to be anything here, so let's climb this ladder now. So you see there's blood on both of his hands, like yeah. One finger on each hand, chopped off. There's no PC gaming for this guy, man. Hey, rip PC gaming for this guy. I can't see. Do we go down? This is the bloody shack that I opened, man. Come on. Then we open this door. And when we go around here, and you open this. No. Then you go here. Oh, man, running around in the dark like this is just. Ugh. It's, it's kind of making me dizzy in a way, man. This is really hard on the eyes, this is, man. Can you move this ladder? There's a pipe underneath. Yeah, Ghost, Ghost Moron, the main protagonist of GTA Sun is a camera guy named Carl. <laughs> oh, 
all that. Alright, so let's go up here again. I'm guessing I missed something up here. There's no point falling back down only to wind up where we were before. Maybe there's somewhere... See, look, look, like that, that thunder was my only light, man. I've got to wait for the thunder each time and see what's there. Come on, thunder, please. There we go, all right. Oh, that was some delayed thunder, man. What the hell? This shed is endless, man. Oh, I think I got. I, I think I got to jump here. All right, you know what? Let's just reload the batteries, man. There we go. There's a there's a dude there. Nice. I'll take those. What you doing out here, bruh? What is this guy doing? He's gonna freeze out here in this cold, man. I mean, there's there's hardly anything on him. You can see pretty much every bone in his body. Like, does he want to talk, man? Hello, talk to me, man. Record me some footage, like. Alright, so... Well, it's not that way. It looks like we're going this way. And then we climb up here. Oh, fuck. He has a scar on his head, like he's missing some brain. <laughs> Here we go, round... I'm trying to conserve the battery power here. I've got to make a running jump now. Right, here we go. There we go. And then... Where do I go from here? What, down? Oh, we made it to the other side of the fence, I guess. That's what we were trying to do. This guy got wrecked. This door is closed. There's no items for me here. So well, let's try climbing up here now. Go up there. How is the battery almost depleted already, man? Are you serious, man? Shit, we're loading a new area, dropping frames. Oh, this is tense, man. This place looks like... Who is this guy? And why is he walking around butt naked, bro? We don't need to see that, man. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? Like? Uh, bro! You can see his brains! You can see his brains! Oh, this is like Resident Evil, man. How, why are these... Why do you have such mutilated faces, look? Like? Well, I wanna try and... Well, you ain't getting out from here. Not with you crooked up like that, man. Well, we obviously can't open that door. Uh, 
So that door is locked. This is also locked. Uh, Alright, let's go up these stairs here. Looks like it's my only way forward. What is this guy doing? Is he taking a piss? He looks like he's taking a piss. Why are they all in straight jackets? Well, this is, this is a mental institute, so that's why they put them in straight jackets. But damn. This guy got wrecked. Look at that. Like, his, ugh. I'm not even going to attempt to describe that, man. Yes. Thank you for the batteries. I needed those. Wait, wait. This door is sealed for sure in a prison block. Oh, so this is the prison area, man. Can we get through here? No. Come on, surely this area just can't be for sure. There's got to be a way to move around somewhere. Picked up a battery. Nice. Nice. We needed that battery as well. I didn't notice that the first time. There's got to be a way in somehow. Oh, we got we, we got to get out through here. Bruh, why? Saving, all right. Oh my days. Okay. Oh fuck off, he's here. That fat guy with the chains. There he is. He's right there. Shit, where am I supposed to go? Tell me this is open. No? Go, we go this way now, yeah? Nah, bro, that guy can fuck off. Seriously, man. He ain't no daddy. He's just a fucking freak for you. He's a, f he's a freak, man. RM says, this was the first game he ever played on the PS4 when the PS4 had just come out back in 2014. Oh, memories, man. Trip down memory lane for you here, man. It's hard to believe all those years have gone by. Where is he? He'll be on that side, isn't it? Well, where do we go from here? Are we going in here? Fuck! Oh, come on, man! Oh, this, this is bullshit, that. That just took the piss right there, like... Okay, you think the first game you played was Mario on original NES because you're old. Yeah, li uh, likewise. So that was my first game as well. So Mario 1 on the NES and uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles on the NES. They were my first two games. And then he just sees you like, and then there's no way to fucking go. Like.
Find Father Martin inside the female ward. Well, no easy access here. Oh, you love Ninja Turtles. Me too, that game was... Uh, the damn level was especially tense in that game, man. Oh, my days. This whole fountain is full of blood. Talk about a fountain of blood, man. Damn. Oof. Okay. Don't drink the water. Well, of course not. Not so much blood in the water. I can smell it. Like putting a penny in your mouth when you were a kid. The whispers are making more sense. I'm looking for static. It's like an itch. Alec Baldwin wants to show you his prop gun. <laughs> Alright, do they have batteries here? No batteries, these guys, man. I mean, they must have their walkie-talkie, so maybe you can remove the battery from their walkie-talkie. Because there's a lot of guards, but they have no walkie-talkie. But sometimes you see them and they have walkie-talkies on them. Alright, which way am I supposed to go, man? Right, looks like we go through here. Saving. Boom. Shit. If the male ward was this sadistic, imagine what the female ward, ward holds. Oh man, I wanted to go to the female wards first, bruh. I want to check out that pussy, you know what I'm saying? That. <laughs> Use the upper floors to reach Father Martin. This guy is a s s psycho. Why are we even following this guy, man? We should be focusing on getting out of here. Not on this, not on this BS revelation. That batteries, batteries, yes. Okay, nice. We got some batteries, man. Door is closed. Can't go through here, man. At least father didn't try to rip your head off. Wait, he bloody in injected you, put you to bloody sleep, and then... And then put you in the bloody cell, like... When we were literally almost out of here, man. In, in fact, he's the reason why we're all in this... Why, why, why this character's in this mess, man. Challenge it, man. Open the door. Show me who's there, bruh. No fear, man. No fear. High risk gameplay, like. Oh, crap. I'm not liking this. Here we go. Is that him? Why is it so dark in here, man? What is this? Oh, that's a tumble dryer. Like. Who, who the hell is doing the laundry, man? Okay, the sound in the machine, like the sound in my head when the ward rider appeared. I blink and I see static. Something else. Something oily and dark descending behind my eyelids. Watching me with organs I can't imagine. But the sound is coming from the machine, too. From inside the walls. I know that sound. I don't understand what he means here. 
A senator says, if you ask me, it's better to be drugged than getting circumcised by the good doctor. <laughs> getting circumcised? But he only had his fingers cut off, man. What is this? Now's not the time to be playing blackjack, man. Why is the music all gone all crazy all of a sudden? Well, he's not female, and this is supposed to be the female ward. I don't want to go in there just yet, man. Now what? Uh-oh. I don't like the sound of that. Did he fucking just turn off the electric again? This whole game is dark as fuck, man. I'm going in circles. Let's just go through here, man. Boy, this place is nuts. I just heard someone splash the water. Like. Let's go outside. Nope. That's not gonna happen. So, can we open this door? Nope. Ah, so, there's a way downstairs. Use the upper floors to reach Father Martin. So, we've got to go up, not down. So, why am I going down like a plum? Oh, because I want to check the area and find some batteries. That's why. Shit, that guy looks dangerous. Like. Oh yes. Gimme, give gimme. Give so we did find some batteries and a notebook. That's good, man. So now what we do is we read the documents. Let's see what it says here. Project Paperclip excerpt. <clears throat> Project Paperclip, Joint Intelligence Objectives, Agency JIIO, Document Number 8 of 186, blah. Okay. Yeah, I remember I remember hearing about pa Project Paperclip. It had something to, something to do with either the US or the USSR at the time taking the scientists from Nazi Germany after Nazi Germany got defeated, like. Okay, the first paper clip provides a means of obtaining services of foreign specialties for specific assignments within the technical services of the departments of Army, Navy, and Air Force. Project 63 is primarily a denial program. With utilization as a desirable feature, the aim of this program is to secure employment in the United States of certain preeminent German and Austrian specialists, thus denying their services to potential enemies. 
Oh, so that was their excuse. Yeah, it was the US in it. And then the US took the, the, the German scientists and then they used them in the Manhattan Project, which was to make the atom bomb. I think that's how things went, man. So up we go. Are you serious, man? There we go. Uh, we're getting closer to this father guy. And he better have some serious answers, man. This guy. I swear, this guy's being such a tease right now. Every time you get closer to him, he just moves further away and says, I'm, I'm, I'm over here, come and get me. Ugh. Okay. I know it just brought back your memories, memories, cards, CRT monitors, OTV, CDs, DVDs. <laughs> I'll go through here. I'm not liking the sound of this. Okay. What, there's a key here. The laundry chute needs three fuses. Are you serious, man? We gotta get that key. You can't open this door. This guy got wrecked. I don't like the look of this. Pray for a revelation. Oh, what revelation are you talking about, man? Are you serious? Pray for revelation. What the fuck? What are they doing? I mean, he's got a fucking meat cleaver in his hand, man. I'm gonna have to find this out the hard way, man. My days. Damn, he got... He got destroyed. Why, why, why are you chasing me for, bruh? Why are you chasing me for, bruh? How? Well, 
Did you jump over? Oh. oh, there we go. Okay. Holy shit! Oi, leave me alone, Brian. Do nothing to you, man. Oh, damn. Okay, my sweet people. <sighs> I think I'm gonna call it a session here. How long have we been live for? We've been live for about oh yeah, three hours. Yeah, I'm gonna call it a session here, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. I'm certainly enjoying the game. I'm your host, Ultimate Mill 420, and this wraps up part two of our blind run of Outlast on the PC in Stereoscopic 3D. I hope you guys have enjoyed the show. Remember, feel free to uh, check out the social links, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't done so already, and oh yeah, the Discord as well. I'm sure many of you have joined, but uh, feel free to join if you haven't. And Vakita says, you may have spilled beer on your desk. Oh no, were you watching in the dark? Did you move your hands in panic and then spill, and then you accidentally spilled beer? You did? Oh, 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 shit. Oh, I'm sorry. That, I'm sorry. <laughs> you got to clean that up, though. Make sure it, uh, you know, it doesn't go into your keyboard and stuff. All right, my sweet people, let's save the game. Save and exit. And I'll be seeing you in part three tomorrow with this game. We'll continue this game to completion and then we'll move on to the sequel. That is the plan. Hopefully the plan goes smoothly and then I can tick these two games off nice and smooth, man. So, I'll see you in part three. Until then, do take care. Let's see if we